Hey you guys, it's Peter! Ah! It is like 7.30 and I haven't been vlogging at all today. I have been so busy. I was working in my office and then I had to go run a bunch of errands and then I came home and look, oh my God, I finally set up my lights for filming. And the reason I didn't set them up earlier for those people that keep on asking me, if you guys don't know, Letty sent them to me and she was so wonderful is that back there, there are like no light switches and back over there, it doesn't stretch. So I had to get extension cords and I kept on forgetting to get extension cords. And then like the setup, I was worried because when I would film it, it would look so too bright. And I was always in a hurry filming things. And so I finally figured out how to set them up. So, but the problem is, do you see how high it is? And it's so like our ceilings are so high in here. Oh, that it's like really, really hard because there's so many shadows on me when I'm filming. So it'll probably be better during the day, but at night, like it's just, it's so shadowy in here. So, I mean, even like, do you just see over here? Like, look, do you see the shadows? Only the shadow knows. So right now I'm uploading a video. Um, so many people contacted me about Joy Graceffa did a video talking about his um, alcoholic mom and how he's having a hard time dealing with stuff with her. And everybody reached out to me and was like, will you please make a video response to that? And I was like, well, I don't really want to do that because I don't want to come across as like disingenuous. But then I thought, well, if it helps a person, somebody out there, I guess I could share my story about my mom being an alcoholic and getting sober. So I just filmed that. And yeah, and now I am vlogging and uploading and it's been a really good day. Um, my cousin and I decided today that we were just going to kind of like, well, she decided that she just needed a night to herself. And so I'm just kind of doing my thing. Alex is out to dinner with a girlfriend, catching up that he hasn't seen for a while. And he's going to come home and we're going to watch a movie. We're supposed to have an ice storm in Indianapolis tonight. So I went to the grocery store and to the Dollar Tree, because I'm doing that video in a second, and got a bunch of just like junk food and stuff. So... Anyway, I hope you guys are doing well. Um, I'll try to do some fun stuff tonight or <laughs> show you what how exciting my life is once I'm home, but not very. Hi, Boo Radley. Hi, Mr. Boo Radley. Boo Radley, what's the meaning of the world, Boo Radley? Hello, Mr. Pee Pee. Hello, Mr. Boo Radley. Pee Pee, Boo Radley. Since everybody thinks I don't cook, let me just show you my dollar store purchases. First, I bought deluxe macaroni and cheese for a dollar, made with real cheese. I doubt it. No, this is not an ASMR video. I bought Haribo Twin Snakes. I bought Mrs. Freshly's Swiss Cakes for Alex, because he loves those. And I bought Buddy Bars. It's a very healthy night. Oh, and I bought Lemon Lunch <laughs> Cookies. Look, I'm cooking. Can you even believe it? Peter cooks a meal. Peter cooks a meal. I just want to tell you a true story. Pee pee, true story. Tell us the news of the world, pee pee. True story that macaroni and cheese, a dollar, a dollar store. What do you think I'm going to say? Um, Hands down, the nastiest macaroni and cheese I've ever had in my entire life. You guys, I absolutely love macaroni and cheese. I cannot even finish it. I'm like, it, it tastes like, it's like chalky. It doesn't even taste like cheese. It tastes like, it's so weird. Okay, so it says don't rinse the pasta. And so when I brought the pasta out, I was like, it smells like the horse barn at the state fair. Do you agree, Pee Pee? I was like, God, it smells so bad. And then it, I didn't rinse it because it said not to rinse it. And I put it, the cheese in there and it's just like. Her outfit was fashion forward. I love the McRib. I'm watching Project Away and they have. What's her face on there? Will this be a good, will this be a good tripod? Well, not dad. <laughs> Oh, uh, what to do, what to do. <sighs> Can't we just have nice things, damn it. When you're a YouTuber, like, you constantly are trying to, like, Jimmy Rig shut up. Look at that. <laughs> constantly trying to Jimmy Rig some stuff up to work. <laughs> like, you're literally leaning on my headphones right now, and I'm giving 15 chins and looking like everybody's grandpa. I need to get my shit together so I start looking good. 
This is like a video of me just talking to my dogs, right, peeps? <laughs> I need to get my shit together. I need to get thin and in shape. I need to get rid of this beard. And I need to... I don't know. I just need a lot. I need a lot. Friday night. Just got paid. Monday. You guys remember that song? Guess what I'm doing? Alex is getting ready to come home. We're supposed to have this ice storm. I just said that to you guys. It's still not here yet. I'm uploading this foolish video that I did, um, which will probably lose me a thousand subscribers because it's so silly. But anyway, um, so he's coming home and it's like it hasn't even started raining out yet or icing or whatever it's supposed to do. So I'm going to get Tanya. We're going to go get a fountain coke and then I'm going to come home and maybe watch a movie then, I guess. I don't I don't know. Life is so exciting. My aunt's funeral is on Tuesday. And so Monday, like, everybody will come into town. And I'm not working Monday and Tuesday. And then this weekend, we're just kind of relaxing and stuff. I don't know if I would. I don't remember what I said anymore in my previous videos. Look at all those books. And can I just tell you how many more books I have? Not mine. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Do you know what that means right there? Wise motherfucker. <laughs> My husband got a new computer. I did. Do you love it? Mm-hmm. <sighs> How was your day? It was good. What'd you have to eat at P.F. Chang's? I had the Indian noodles. <laughs> beef Mongoli Mongolian beef. Um, Jessica got the Mongolian beef. Did so you I share had, some of it? So I had a couple bites. I wrote my whole eulogy for my aunt's funeral. You did. Uh huh. It's really cute. Good. It's very creative. Are you like doing like an interpretive dance, creative, or like a ribbon dance? <laughs> I wish a ribbon dance. I wish I had. What is going on here? Why is it doing focusing like that? I don't know. But like this is like the worst angle on like anyone in the world. <sighs> Bradley. Mm. How was your day? Was it good? It was good. It was busy. I worked a lot. I, hey. Um, I worked on like five and a half blog posts for the practice and I set up all like, um, <laughs> Bill Radley's so funny. the social media login and tomorrow I have to like research a new like, like layout theme for the blog. Well, that's cool. You don't have to work on Sunday, do you? Mm-mm. <sighs> and then you took Tuesday off for the funeral, right? Yeah. This is us with our dogs. How long does it take you to load up your computer? Um, I don't know. I just, I was just on it, and then it did some kind of an update, so I guess it's just... Pee-pee. <laughs> <laughs> pee pee. Everybody needs to go um, read the blog that I'm working on for now. Okay, well, I'll link it below. It's called Obesity Center. It's for fat people. It's for people that are trying to lose weight. Yeah, but that's like, the industry that he's in. But it's also for people that like are afraid about it or people that are just inquisitive <sighs> and people that are trying to be comfortable with like Bill Radley? With their relationship with food. Or actually trying to change their relationship with food. Mm, I'm changing my relationship with food after I ate that. I got macaroni and cheese from the dollar store. It was so nasty. It was the nastiest macaroni and cheese I've ever had in my entire life. Right, it's from the dollar store. I know, but I thought it's just macaroni and cheese, but it was so bad. I have worn my glasses now two days in a row. What's wrong with that? No, oh, I just, there's nothing wrong with it. I wear my glasses every day. I know you do. Oh, it's flying Boo Radley. Does her breath smell better now that I've used that breath spray in the water? No. Our dogs have bad breath. Boo Radley's so cute. He says, do you want to hear my prophecies? I'll tell you my prophecies. Boo Radley, what's your prophecy of 2017? He said, I'll tell you if I want to. <laughs> Last night I said, Boo Radley, Boo Radley. I said, you want to move to Hawaii? He goes, 
if I want to, I will. <laughs> it's where where you live, because I live in a house like Swiss Family Robinson if I want, maybe. <laughs> what could you be looking at me? Well, what will you eat, Boo Radley? I don't know, maybe a pineapple if I want. It's up to me, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> what would you eat, Pee Pee? Oh, she can see this. <laughs> Pee Pee. What would Pee Pee eat? Pee Pee would eat a filet mignon. <laughs> he loves steak. <laughs> Do you remember when Heather would leave the Capitol Grill and she would get her dog steak, filet mignon? She would feed them her leftover. <laughs> PB. This is like basically our life. Somebody sent me this Snapchat today and it was like, I can't remember who it was, but they were like, all their dogs were in their bed and they're like, does your dogs ever take over your bed? I'm like, literally every day. Literally. Literally. Boo Radley. What? <laughs> <laughs> what would you do if you went, would you snorkel? He said, I'd snorkel if I wanted to. I might want to see a sea urchin. I don't know. Let's we'll see. <laughs> Boo Radley, don't you want to make plans? Stop bothering me, please. <laughs> don't you want to make plans for when you go to Hawaii? I might, I don't know. I might want to go to Seattle instead. Why do you want to go to Seattle? Seattle. I might want to see a band. Don't worry about it. It's up to me, though. <laughs> what band might you want to see? I don't know. Worthana. <laughs> that was really bad. That was really bad. Boo Radley, hi. Oh, he says, could you leave me alone now, please? Thank you. If, he goes, I might want to go to Hawaii now. This, I'm not a movie star. Would you like a watermelon? He goes, I don't know, maybe if I want. <laughs> <It's so dumb. laughs> he said, Dad, can I please be on the camera? Thank you. I said, Pippi, you can do whatever you want. You Famous YouTuber, Pee Pee the dog. This is us snuggling the sweet. He's my best friend in the whole world. I love you, Pee Pee. Do you love me? Aww. This is how we go to bed every night. You wanna see? And look.